it might be time to see a dermatologist. Losing some hair every day is normal, but having handfuls in the shower or noticing a bunch on your pillow, you could be dealing with something called telogen effluvium. On average, we lose about 100 hairs a day as part of the normal hair cycle. Hair grows, then rests, then falls out, and repeats. Most of your hair is growing in what we call the antigen phase. A smaller portion is resting, and then a very small portion is falling out. Telogen effluvium, or TE, is when something shocks your system and pushes more hair than usual into that resting or telogen phase, all at once. And then two to three months later, all that hair that was pushed into this resting phase falls out. And that's when you have this big shedding event, which can feel so sudden and dramatic. So what can really shock your system to do this? Let's take a look. Major illnesses, especially if you have a fever, things like COVID, surgeries, pregnancy and childbirth, rapid weight loss, I'm looking at you, Ozempic, emotional stress, thyroid issues or iron deficiency, or even some new medications. The good news, telogen effluvium is usually temporary. It often takes anywhere from three to six months to start resetting and growing back. But the trigger obviously needs to be resolved for this to happen. So if you think you're going through this, dermatologists are the experts in here to help you figure it out and get you back on track. And remember, no, biotin is not the answer. Really, the answer is just time. But we're here to help guide you and rule out other things that could be contributing to the hair loss.